Hello, y'all. This is DJ Exotic, and you're watching Hard Noise Inc. Video Vision. Um, right now, I am in the process of rebuilding my studio. Y'all must heard that my PC just died on me, and um, I'm building another one right now, pretty soon. Um, but before I tell you about that, I'm going to show you what my new DJ setup is. Um, Right now I'm using the Tractor Control X1 that is mini map mount able to so any device you got. I got a uh, mapped up to my Serato. Three of these knobs on this top on this left side of the deck is my effects. I mean I can turn on the effects. Blend them. And these right here are my um pitch bar, which I'm gonna get down pretty soon. This down here is my um deck player. What I'm calling it right now. Um, this is my play button, my uh, back button, forward and back when I got to bend the track when I'm mixing or blending. This is my rollovers, and this right here is my uh, crate jump. Go these up and down the crates. Um, these right here, absolute, revelate mode, and turtle mode, just to get my decks go out. And when I hit the shift key, I got a second page. Um, these right here is my left deck and my right deck to insert tracks. These right here is to eject my tracks. And I don't got nothing mapped on these top or these on the bottom yet. But I will be doing that pretty soon. But um, as of now, um, I got this curve set up right now. This is the way I got it. I like it. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm a little sick. Uh, this right here is a Pioneer CDJ 400 with a firmware 1.3 update. Um, I got no connections to the mixer. I'm doing it with a USB cord to my laptop. And I'm still using the SL1 box, but I will be updated to SL3 box in next year, probably in the fall. The mixer, on the other hand, I'm going to get another mixer from um, Ecker Mixers or Pioneer. I'm still debating what kind of mixer I want three or four channels um, <laughs> but uh, hopefully I'll make my choice pretty soon next year but um back to the PC um right now my PC is completely dead uh two, ca two of the capacitors went out and I'm hopefully my hard drive didn't wipe out everything because I gotta take out some software from there and put in my external hard drive but I'm not gonna use it on this one I'm gonna get the TP hard drive pretty soon the TP2 um, the motherboard I get, I'm gonna get for my new PC is the Atus PC uh, I'm gonna add a, a HD via card and a mini control slash audio card for my music producing but um, this PC is gonna be mainly for making videos and music and um, hopefully when I do that um, I can stay ahead because I'm trying to step up in my uh, music. Also, I'm, I'm going to get back into industrial again because uh, for a long, long time I've been listening to industrial and it's getting better and better every year. And like, I want to get back into it pretty soon and hopefully I can. But um, as for producing hardstyle and hardcore, I will try my best to do it. I know I can do it in hardcore because I've done it before plenty of times. And I had DJs spinning my music before, but like hardcore is going to be very easy for me to step into. But, um, let's see. I will let you have a preview of what I'm working on, but right now I got to wait to my hard drive, get out on the PC, and put in my new PC when I get it built up. <laughs> but, um, the new sounds I'm working on, um, is a little bit of industrial kind of hardcore, but, um, I'm not. I'm thinking about not releasing to the public yet because right now I'm kind of like talking to a good friend of mine who want who want me to release the song, but I don't want to release the song. But um, if I start releasing the songs, I'll let y'all know what kind of music I'll be releasing. But as of now, I'm not releasing my current songs because I don't think that it should be in the public place yet. Not because they suck, but they're really good. But I don't feel the songs are not good enough for any kind of hardcore DJ. I mean, here in America, the people will like it, but in the UK, they want something really hard and very aggressive. But, um, 
As for hard style, I've done three attempts of learning how to do a hard style. I can do the easy way of the the kick and the bass line. But the one when people are calling it new style, nude style, where the bass line goes to the bottom and up, follow the melodies and stuff like that, I don't know how to do it. It's kind of pretty hard on me and pretty tricky to do it. But hopefully I get it down because I got people telling me what I need to do. But, uh... I will jump into the hard house scene, I mean hard style scene pretty soon because like it's 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 basically the simple way how to do in hard house. But it's different. It's my it's like working with um trance again, but different. Uh harder and lighter sounds, different kind of saws and leaves and stuff like that. But um hopefully I get it down. But uh as of now, I am not taking any gigs until I get everyday set up to my studio so I can get better while I'm doing that because I'm trying to get you Trying to get used to these CDJs. And, um, because the majority of the clubs, they don't got turntables anymore. And they're using CDJs. And this is the reason why I want to show you this video, because I want to let y'all know that I'm doing CDJs and, you know, like it very much. I shouldn't jump into it real soon, but, um, I didn't have the money to do it. But, um, hopefully. If I got enough money, I could sell my 400s to get a 2000 or 850 with the former update. But um, I'll let y'all know as soon as possible what's new. Also, keep an eye on these three mixes. One is called Critical Mass. Y'all must have the. Um, well, actually, I don't know if I released the demo out yet on the public place. I think I did, but I did. But um, I do got an intro of the song. I will probably post that up next week. But um, the hard style mix I'm working on, which is going to be more of an uplift kind of hard style. Not that hard stomp kind of style, but uplift. And the third mix, which I'll be working on, is going to be the new style of music I'll be working on for a good while. And um, I think most people will like it, most people won't like it. But they, I'm bringing something new on the table here at Texas. But um, as for um, industrial music, I will be doing that pretty soon. Really, really, really soon. <laughs> Uh, I'm getting, getting back in the groove, so I gotta sign off and let y'all go. Uh, post any comments or what y'all want to know about the mixes and the gigs. I might be getting booked in for next year, but um, post some comments on YouTube videos, alright? Alright, see you later.